What's going on everyone? Model Deer Farmer back with you today on American Farming and we are going to get to work here today. First off, I got to unload this combine. Keep him rolling here so we can keep harvesting corn, keep things moving along. And then we, we got some cattle stuff to do here today as well. So don't worry, we'll be getting into that here in a little bit. But we'll pull under here, let him start unloading. And we will keep things moving here. I don't remember how many helpers I have right now, but um, I want fertilizer put down in this field, but I think, oh, we are stuck on the sprayer. I forgot. We got the sprayer going right now on this field. Once he finishes, which he only has one pass left, we'll get the planter going here, get to work planting this field. We're kind of catching up on some things here because I ran a lot of hay stuff. Sorry, I did get all of, nope, that is not what I wanted. I did get all of our um, hay all bailed up, so sorry we won't get to see that this time, but we will be making more hay, so don't worry about that. Um, he's getting finished up here. We are gonna check our animal feed here, our dairy, our dairy cows are out of food, which brings us to what we're going to be working on hopefully today. Um, our hogs look to be all good to go on food, so we don't have to worry about that. Uh, we're going to get this thing folded up here. Never mind. We're going to put it back out and do this little spot that he missed there. Now we're going to get it folded up. Take it right over here, get it waiting, because then once we get this field planted, we will start getting all of our fertilizer and stuff put down on this field. There we go, we can get this one going here, planting that field now. So he's gonna get that done, shouldn't take him too long. Now we're going to head over to here, because right now it's December and I have nothing else to do at the moment because I don't really wanna cut more hay. We need a little bit more money here actually we need a lot more money but um our hogs aren't going to sell for the best price right now so we're going to grab a trailer of milk here i think we probably will have a full load there we go i believe that's full we're gonna go take this to town get it sold off having a second semi truck would be pretty nice but it costs a lot of money and right now we will be fine with just this one but i would love to get another one eventually here Pull up on top of here, and we will get our milk sold. Looks like we're gonna get a little over 11 grand for that. So that'll be pretty good. I believe with that, we will be able to purchase our um, two row forage harvester. Now, is that gonna take forever? Yes, but we'll do it because we need to feed cows. Now, also with that though, we are going to need this forage wagon, which is 35 grand. And we don't have 35 grand yet. So we're going to have to wait here a little bit. We need about 30 grand more. Hogs will be selling pretty soon in a little bit. Then we'll be able to afford that and get that rig going. We're going to be done with the milk trailer for right now because we don't really have much more to haul out. So we're going to come over here and get the livestock trailer because we are going to be selling hogs here pretty soon so I think we're gonna grab a load of them and take them on into town sounds like our combine is full though so we're gonna have to go take care of him before we get on taking those hogs down so we want to keep him rolling here heading into town with a load of hogs got this load of corn here pretty much about full but all of our hogs do have enough food right now so we're just gonna throw this in the bin for the time being because the grain cart's about full, and so we're gonna need to go unload that here pretty soon. I wonder, I haven't really been using this grain gravity wagon over here, the little kill bros very much. I'm gonna see if we can make a grain train out of this thing. That didn't work the first time, because in theory we should be able to hook this up, but obviously it's not going to be nice. Uh, there we go. We got all three gravity wagons all hooked up. Now we're going to have the real grain train going and we are going to be able to haul a lot at the same time. Um, this pickup truck's probably not going to like it because it's gotten progressively slower. We can only go 20 mile an hour now, but it is what it is here. 
it'll be fine. Well, the game crashed again. That's nice. Don't know the last time it saved, but I don't want to hook up that gravity wagon again for sure. Ah, we're going to have to do that all again. Come on, American Farming, get this fixed. This is kind of annoying. Well, back to driving the semi-truck. Back to the animal dealer again. Then I guess I get to go hook that trailer up all again, which will be lots of fun. Okay, let's get this thing hooked up again here. These things are so much of a pain to hook up, which is why I really hate that I have to do it a second time. This is about taking longer than it did the first time. Finally, got the grain train hooked back together. Now, get to go see if the game crashes when I try to go pull it into the field over here. Okay, now it's my most favorite time of the year. I get to truck a whole bunch of hogs back and forth there we go sold off our last load of hogs there let's get one more full load of wieners take them back and then we're going to get our forage herbs our forage chopper box purchased and go test out that rig over i don't know wherever we got corn ready there we go we'll go in here purchase that chopper box and i'm gonna go find the pickup that was the pickup darn it we're gonna find the pickup and we're gonna unhook from that and we're gonna go pick this up from the shop the pickup because it's fast and then we'll come back and hook it up to one of our tractors looks like we do have some parts of this field that are ready i had time kind of sped up so everything is a little bit messed up but some of that field ought to work this little pickup truck gets the job done there we go there is our equipment We'll get backed on up here, and then there we go. That is all hooked up. Put it into road gear and get on heading back to the farm. This thing can go 50 with this. That's crazy. We'll get it back in no time. There we go. We'll grab this tractor, head on over there, go test it out real quick. We're not going to get into a lot of it today because we are kind of running out of time with that stupid lag but we'll go ahead and test it out make sure everything works there we go we'll get on hooked up to it we swing it out turn it on it is only two rows gonna take a little while but the only thing we got to work with right now but it's actually taking three rows so um actually we can get four rows so we are pretty lucky there i don't know how long it's gonna take to get a full chopper box here it's looking like it's gonna take a little while unfortunately that progress bar is not going up very much but we are forage harvesting we'll just end up putting this on a helper probably and he can get going do his thing and then we'll be able to feed this to the cattle dairy cows and hopefully uh, we can get some pretty good tonnage off of this and hopefully they'll have food year-round at least that's the hope but we'll see here um but that's probably going to be it for this one guys hope you guys did enjoy the video if you did give it a like also consider subscribing to the channel that'd mean a lot to me we are on the run for 3,000 subscribers on youtube here but i hope you guys enjoyed the video um if you have any comments or questions leave those down in the comment section below but i hope you guys all enjoyed i hope you guys have a great day and i'll see you all in the next one